Hello, this is Reginald Stinson, um, stay-at-home entrepreneur, been doing it for a while, but n enough about me. Basically, in this video, I'm going to give you uh, a success tip on Craigslist. A lot of people aren't aware of this, and basically, this is going to be the tip of the day. I'm not going to give a specific date because I may use this video again, and you may be watching it on another day. Um, contrary to the actual date that I mentioned in the video but I'm gonna basically give you the success tip of the day on Craigslist some of you guys might be aware <coughs> excuse me of this already but a lot of you guys are not now first and foremost uh, there's a site called Craigslist ad tracker .com, and basically what this website gives you the ability to do is to track all your ads on Craigslist. Now I'm not going to do um, a lengthy training on this website because I'm not that familiar with it to be honest. I just started using it uh, through the recommendation of someone that did a training in MLSP. Uh, but the gist of it, it, it allows you to track your ads. Okay, You can do image ads, regular link tracking, uh, so on and so forth. Also what you could do is uh, where is it fancy ad titles All right. so when you see those little arrows and things like that in the titles of Craigslist ads it's because they're using something like this and they put this special code here at the bottom in the actual title which let's go ahead and do a sample one right now and um, of course you know how I feel about Craigslist if you don't um, if you're marketing any opportunity you want to market in a jobs section okay because that's where most people are looking and it's not really being deceptive because I know some people uh, are thinking morally which I am a very moral person however there's no sense in you putting out advertising in places where people aren't looking because you may be feeling guilty for whatever reason so on and so forth the people you are looking for are not looking in the small biz <laughs> section all the time they're looking for a job alright so um, we're gonna do it here do not pay attention to this okay it really doesn't matter what they say and another thing that I just recently discovered is Chris list has gotten real strict oh it didn't copy strict about their ad posting guidelines they change something every month seem like so to be on the safe side um, I wouldn't post any more now to date no more than three ads if you notice your ads start getting ghosted a lot which being ghosted which means uh, your ads appear to be live but when you actually go in on the website and search for them they are nowhere to be found if you notice that start happening a lot what you need to do is to uh, lower your your post quantity, your ad quantity. You know, uh, I heard some people say don't post no more than three ads per account. Uh, try that out. Um, you know, three ads per account. Switch your IP addresses. Clear your cookies uh, before you switch to the other account so that they are not uh, on your computer tracking what you're doing uh, but just don't abuse the website because if you abuse it put out 25 ads um, then you're gonna have a serious problem <clears throat> but for the Craigslist marketers I'm gonna post this in sales okay um, I'm just gonna put that there and put sales pros 100k potential and this is just an example if you watch my other Craigslist training then uh, you should already know most of this and but this is not what I wanted to really show you now in before I get to the crash list tracker let me open this up and basically image ads we're gonna do an image ad today I'm gonna show you how easy it is to do it and I created this image ad in PowerPoint okay so if you have Microsoft PowerPoint you could easily do this I'm not gonna go through the entire process of creating uh, 
this but basically in a nutshell it's just creating a PowerPoint so if you are if you know how to use Microsoft PowerPoint just create a PowerPoint how you want your image ad to look this is just one slide um, I went to Google typed in business women I can I guess I can do that for you let me see I went to google.com typed in business women just for an example I mean you can type in whatever you want and then I went to images and I just chose an image all right something that looks professional you know corporate women however you want it to look and just make sure there's no watermarks or anything like that on the pictures before you use them if you don't see any watermarks then you're good and I downloaded them and I just upload them them to PowerPoint okay then I got a text box put my text there I put my little shape which basically this all this is right here to click here to apply as a shape and then I downloaded this screen capture thing called Jing which you can go to techsmith.com forward slash Jing and it's free alright it's free and once you have it on your computer you're gonna see this little thing up here at the top in the middle of the screen and you just click this I think you just I think yeah that's the right button and then you just position it top corner drag it over like that so and then click the save or capture image and then there's the image turn the PowerPoint into an image <coughs> excuse me I'm trying to get the code here and then save second button select where you want to save it I'm gonna click desktop so I can easily find it and bam that's it so there's my image ad now the reason why you want to use an image ad and the reason why I suggest it now um, is through testing I found that image ads convert a lot better and you, you can make them clickable all right which is what we're gonna do here so in order for you to make them clickable you need to have Craigslist ad tracker okay and with Craigslist ad tracker they switch their links or something like that and um, your ads don't get ghosted as much once you use this because of their technology that they have okay so that's why I'm recommending this it's like probably I forgot how much it costs <coughs> but I will have a link somewhere um, by the time I produce this video that you can go to to get a special rate on it alright but um, let's see where am I going trackers let's do image okay so you want to click on image tracking then over here click on upload image then click add files I'm gonna go to my desktop and find the image and there it is then click upload files and then here's the one I just uploaded here and then basically all you need to do once you back here is it gives you a special code for the image so I'm just gonna highlight all the code click copy okay and then go to link tracking and then you can title it so you'll know like if you creating an image ad for each city or for each post uh, which is something I would probably do to kind of track I'm gonna do Nashville ad and then I'm gonna paste the image code here that I just got from Craigslist ad tracker okay so you can either do link text just text only like click here to apply in your ad like if you wanted to do a hyperlink or you can do the image which I recommend do the image then I'm gonna put my URL and basically this is the destination URL that I want people to go once they click on the ad 
and then you can do impressions plus clicks which I recommend you leave it there so you'll know how many times people see your ad you can do an expiration date which I just leave that blank tracking group like you can do skinny body care ads um, ACN ads whatever opportunity you're in or whatever you're doing an ad on you can track them with groups but in this case well I'm gonna select that because that's an ad and then you click on generate code then once you generate the code you just highlight all the code scroll down get it all right click copy and then just go back to Craigslist paste the code in there I'm gonna do 100k potential there and just be creative with your ad titles as well this is just an example click continue and voila there's the ad okay you see isn't that beautiful wouldn't you click on this quicker than you would a test ad and if you notice you see in the title that little arrow is pointing toward the ad so that's going to make your ad stand out from the competition now if I wanted to put more I probably would put three like paste the, that weird code space paste that code again space paste the code make sure you put a space behind it well you, I don't know do you need to really um or disregard that I'm not sure if you need to put a space or not but you could have pasted that code up here in the title three times and it would have had three arrows pointing at your title which would make your ad stand out from the rest and then click continue again of course and then you do the rest whatever you do on Craigslist to get your ad going and that's it so let me see what's going on show you something so there it is right there the little symbol there so if I would have put three I would have had three arrows pointing to it and here's some examples here at the bottom you see these right here these three arrows so if somebody's searching for a job they see those three arrows point at the ad they're more likely to click on mine versus yours if yours don't have it so that's just an example and a brief tutorial on how to create an image a high converting image ad so to speak so make sure that you apply what I just showed you today play with it it's pretty simple and easy to figure out and hopefully that helps you guys so um, again I want to see you make money I want to see you win so apply this and we will see you on the next video. Take care. God bless.